What is up everyone, Impact here. I know a lot of you have asked me to continue with my top 5 supports for solo queue series, but I had some other stuff that I wanted to focus on, so I didn't really make any of those videos for the last two patches. However, I'm going to start doing that again, but a little bit differently. I'll be naming 5 champions in no particular order, meaning that if I mention them last, it doesn't mean that they're the best right now or the worst. But let's get to it. First off, I have to name Thresh because it's the Hook King. Hook. King. Alright, let's just skip that joke. He's the definition of OPness. Okay, this is really not going the way I wanted it to. He's a playmaker. There. I think I've got the hang of this. His kit is still incredibly strong, no matter how much Riot decides to nerf him. Even with the Soul Despawn timer being reduced, he still has damage, lane presence, mid and late game power, pickoff potential, as well as amazing presence in teamfights. So why wouldn't you pick this badass champion? He's awesome. Secondly, Leona, because she shines bright like a da God damn it, Impact! Incredibly strong CC base kit, incredibly tanky, and she can and will snowball a lane if you know exactly what to do with her. Definitely one of the best supports to carry with in solo queue, in my opinion. Plus, and just like Thresh, if you're doing with your jungler, you can easily set up ganks for him, further increasing the odds of a successful gank, which you could hypothetically follow up with an objective like Dragon or a turret. Third, Velka. <laughs> nah, I'm just, uh, I'm just kidding, guys. <laughs> I actually meant Annie. We all know her base damage got nerfed and that she can't burst people down early game as easily as before, but she'll still kill you and spam laugh in your face if you're not careful. Plus, if you enjoy building damage on her, she'll be even stronger now because she actually scales better, meaning that you'll be better off late game with the same items than you used to be. You're now better at one-shotting the enemy ADC when you reach one or two items in level 11. And that's always one way of winning solo queue game, right? Supporting, soloing the enemy carries? GG. And my fourth pick would have to be Karma. Thank goodness KTB showed her true potential during the IEM World Championship. Incredible range, incredible damage, and she's one of those supports that you can build Spell Thief Sage on, meaning she'll be awesome for sieging turrets even early on. Plus, she gets gold for doing so, meaning you'll be able to get your build going incredibly fast. She's skill shop based, meaning she does require some practice to get used to, but she's actually easy to get into and amazingly fun to play. And my last pick, and I'm truly, truly sorry for not including this goddess of the bottom lane in my previous videos, would have to be Morgana. Okay, let's just start with the most OP crap ever. 3 second snare. Three frickin' second snare. Can you imagine the damage that a Draven can dish out in three seconds during the laning phase after he hit a binding? It's just insanely good. Plus, your tormented soil deals more damage the lower your enemies are, allowing for a better snowball. Her black shield help helps countering the other best supports right now, and she can even engage or disengage with her ult. If you're playing a protect the carry style of game, just wait for the enemy bruisers or assassins to jump onto your carries and use the ult. And there. Fight has been won. Lastly, you can also build Spell Thief Sedge on her, as well as other damage items. A well-played Morgana can carry a game, but I wouldn't know anything about it because my win ratio is actually below 50%. <laughs> Not that it matters, right? <sighs> Anyway, that's it for this video, guys. If you still haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you do so. I release new videos just like this one every week, and you can also follow my stream because, well, when I'm not releasing videos, I'm actually streaming. So yeah, follow, subscribe, follow, etc. And I'll catch you guys next video with a full Morgana game. Peace out.